Some minority communities have been slow to accept the COVID-19 vaccines and now many churches are taking on the task of dismantling stigma and distrust and getting shots in arms. Our Michael Laparty has a closer look at the efforts being made in tonight's Stronger Houston. Take a walk with me through Southeast Houston, down the block from Greater St. Matthew Baptist Church. That's my church. At 81, getting around isn't easy for Joyce Harris. I can't stand up no long time. She says she almost didn't get the COVID-19 vaccine. That's until it was offered at her church and a member helped her get there. I said, okay, I'm putting my faith and trust in God because he will take care of me. Across Houston, churches are playing a key role in helping to offer the vaccine to minority communities. And a lot of people will trust their house of faith and they will come. So we we wanted to make sure that we had it available. Gusta Booker III says about 300 doses were administered at last month's event with the health department, many to African Americans. A lot of people in our community are deeply religious and they feel if it's here, they feel comfortable coming here. Senior Pastor DZ Cofield says that comfort also led people to get vaccinated at Good Hope Missionary Baptist Church, which is primarily African American. If those people did not have it, I think some of them may not have chosen to get the vaccine. The most recent census estimates show black people make up around 20% of the population in Harris County, but the state's online dashboard says they only account for around 10% of people totally vaccinated there. Church leaders told us people in their communities face challenges that include a lack of transportation to reach large vaccine sites, a lack of computer access to book online appointments, and distrust of both government and vaccines. There were many who came who said, they were only comfortable coming here and they had delayed getting the vaccine as long as possible. Houston's mayor says the city is working with faith-based groups to reach these communities. We are looking at even going on Sundays when people are coming, going back to church and within mobile units and vaccinating people after the church service is over. Something similar is already being planned at St. Jerome Catholic Church in Northwest Houston. If we can help, we would like to help. Father Dan Shields says more than 80% of the church's families are Hispanic. The parish has hosted several vaccine events so far and another is planned for this room next week. It's now to the point where you can get it almost any drugstore, but I think some might feel more comfortable coming here and getting it. With vaccine supply now outpacing demand, these religious leaders are opening up their houses of worship to give people a little more faith in the shot. Two of the churches we visited are reminding folks that the vaccines are a key part of returning to in-person services. They say that's another reason to get the shot. For Stronger Houston, Michael Loparty, KPRC 2 News.